So let's see how to convert 36 base 10 to base 2. So the first thing you do is you draw a line and you have 36. So from the instruction we wrote down earlier, we expected to break down the number in base 10 by the new base we are converting to, which is base 2, until we have 0. So we have to take note of the remainder. Whenever we break down, whenever we divide it, we need to write down the remainder. So let's divide by 2. We are going to be dividing by 2 because we are converting to base 2. So we have 2. 36 divided by 2 is going to give us 18. When 36 is divided by 2, we are going to have 18. Will there be any remainder? No remainder. So we have remainder 0. So when 36 is divided by 2, we are going to have 18, but remainder 0. So remember, we are breaking it down repeatedly by 2. So we'll divide again by 2. 18 divided by 2 is going to give us 9, remainder 0. We continue again with 2, although 2 is not a factor of 9, but since we are converting to base 2, we are dividing repeatedly by 2. So 2 again. 9 divided by 2 is going to give us 4. But when 9 is divided by 2, we have 4, but there will be a remainder. The remainder is 1. Divide again by 2. 4 divided by 2 is going to give us 2. The remainder is 0. So we go again 2. 2 divided by 2 gives us 1. Will there be a remainder? Our remainder will be 0. We still divide 1 by 2. 1 divided by 2. How many 2 can we find in 1? 0. The remainder 1. Now, you draw an arrow. You don't have to draw this arrow. It's not compulsory, but it just gives us a, a picture of what we are expected to do. So when you want to write the number, this arrow is telling us that we write the number from bottom to the top. That's what the arrow is telling us. This number we have here is the equivalent of 36 base 10 in base 2. So let me see if I can write it here. 36 base 10 is equal to 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, base 2.